In this video, you are going to learn about gravitational potential energy. This is the energy that an object has due to its position relative to some zero point. What do I mean by this? Well, imagine we have this person who's standing on the top of a cliff and we set the zero point to be the ground. Well, that means that the person is some height above zero. And that height gives the person potential energy. And it's called potential energy because the object's position gives it the potential to gain kinetic energy. So for example, if this person jumped off the cliff, we know that gravity is going to accelerate them. So they start speeding up as they fall down. And as they speed up, they gain kinetic energy. Now, if you need to calculate an object's gravitational potential energy, you can use this equation, which says that the potential energy is equal to mgh, where m is the mass of the object in kilograms. g is the acceleration due to gravity. And if your object is on Earth, that would be equal to 9.8 meters per second squared. And h is the object's height relative to the zero point and U is the gravitational potential energy, and it has units of joules. And one last note is that if you need to solve for the change in gravitational potential energy, you can use this equation, which says that the change in potential energy is equal to the final potential energy minus the initial potential energy. Now let's do an example to practice using the gravitational potential energy equation. In this question, we have an astronaut on a distant planet who has a mass of 50 kilograms. And we are told that they gain 800 joules of potential energy when they climb up a 10 meter tall ladder. And we wanna know what is the acceleration due to gravity on this planet? Well, we'll start by writing our gravitational potential energy equation. And now we wanna solve for the acceleration due to gravity so we will rearrange and isolate for g. And then all we need to do is plug in our values for the potential energy, the mass, and the height. And when we do that, we find that the acceleration due to gravity is about 1.6 meters per second squared. And with that, that's the end of this lesson on gravitational potential energy.